Welcome to this short demo of Instant Chime, where we're going to demonstrate the agent's ability to use our automatic language translation, which is actually leveraging Azure Language Translation Service. So here, an employee comes in and they're asking for help with a password, and uh, they're coming in uh, in German. So they're going to go through our first welcome card, which can be customized, but in this case, it's just asking to describe their issue. They'd like to speak with a live agent. At this point, we're going to uh, find a live agent somewhere in the world to help them. And on the agent side, uh, we're going to invoke uh, automatic language translation. So here, the employee is going to continue to, to speak or type in German. The agent is an English-speaking agent, but uh, we're going to automatically translate uh, between German to English and English back to German. So here the employee is having a conversation in their native German. Uh, they're connected with a service desk agent uh, who's using uh, English and having translation. Here's just a brief overview of a manager display. So this is sort of a little bit behind the scenes where a manager portal uh, is available. Managers can see all the active chats and they can also uh, look at those chats. And then there are a collection of dashboards and reports and other things that managers can use. Um, flipping back to the employee looking for help, um, they're going to wrap up their conversation with the agent and then um, get a feedback card uh, and then go on their way. In just a second, we're just going to switch perspectives. We're going to show the agent side of this. And the agent in this case is going to be using the Chimes um, web UI, agent web UI, and they're going to accept the, the conversation using the agent dashboard. So here now we'll flip to the agent side. The agent um, sees the request come in through this uh, dashboard portal. Uh, they can they can watch the the state of the conversation change. Initially, the the employee is provided with some um, adaptive cards. They might have an interview. They might have some other questions that are asked. But in this case, the agent's now accepting the chat, and they're going to get the Chime agent UI. The agent's just going to reply back in their native English, and we're automatically going to translate that over to German. We saw that the question came in in German, so we're going to translate it uh, over to them. Agents also have a variety of other tools. They can see a history of this uh, person who's looking for help, so they can load up a history if they want to look at earlier conversations. They can also get access to standard replies, so common replies that they may want to send are all part of this agent UI as well. Those are configured at the queue level, so agents have access to all those standard replies that they could send. Um, agents also can see and have access to an Azure Q&A service, so there might be common answers that are provided via Q&A, obviously file attachments. They can attach notes to this session. Here, the agent is going to mark this as resolved. Um, and then agents can also see metadata, so it could be additional information that could be associated with this chat is available as well. So just a brief demonstration. Um, agents have access to a default language translation service. Uh, Chime will try to de determine that translation setting automatically based on the conversation text. And this is all available in Chime for Microsoft Teams. Thanks very much.